What's good, everyone? This is your boy DJ's Raw and Cut Truth, give you the raw content that you deservedly need. And today we have a question that needs to be answered Can Logan Paul defeat Floyd Mayweather? Hmm, let me think about it. Hail to the no. Now, I'm going to give Logan Paul his credit. Logan Paul and his brother Jake Paul. They're doing a thing on social media. They're controlling YouTube with their content. They're very popular on Twitter, Instagram, and various other uh, social media platforms. They're on fire right now on TikTok. They have mastered a way to perfect capturing the audience attention. They're very good at it. And I give those two brothers credit for taking advantage of how today's society is. Don't hate the player, hate the game, man. Uh, The Paul brothers are winning right now. And they deserve the right to be showcased. And they deserve the right to have the type of clout they have. They worked for it. I know a lot of people don't want to hear it, but they worked for it. When you work very hard, you get leeway you get things that others cannot afford to get you know sometimes people say they're spoiled brats and they just came to YouTube fame uh, unbeknownst but they had to put in work they had to make a bunch of videos they gotta get it showcased to a point where they're monetized at a high level they get sponsorship deals they're in movies So when you work hard, you get the type of shit you want. As for Floyd Mayweather, uh, during the promotion of this fight, there have been boxers present and past who have criticized this. But we have seen something like this before. Um, Floyd Mayweather went into the WWF and WWE try to uh, fight the big show. (laughs) Uh, Mike Tyson was part of Degeneration X in the late 90s for my old wrestling fans out there. Um, Muhammad Ali tried to fight wrestlers as a publicity stunt in the late 70s. So it's happened before. So I'm not going to be a hypocrite and just Floyd Mayweather for doing the same thing. As we've seen before, Jake Paul challenged Nate Robinson. He kicked his ass. And he became a viral sensation after that from the knockout. Do I think this is going to happen with this fight? No. Floyd Mayweather is a trained boxer. He's done this for years. He has not lost a match. Even though this is an exhibition, the only way Logan Paul can win this matchup is if Floyd Mayweather decides to give this game away. If he does not try at all. If he doesn't even get 50%. Maybe he'll have a shot. But there was 50 fighters. Who challenged Floyd Mayweather. Trained. Ranked in the nation. And still couldn't do it. On their best day. So why do you think that. Logan Paul may have a chance now. Now I'm going to show you a clip. Of a trained fighter. But he's not trained in boxing. And he couldn't even beat Floyd Mayweather. And Floyd Mayweather wasn't even putting the effort. I'm going to show you. He was able to land that punch very effectively. Here's a great right hand by Floyd Mayweather. Another straight by straight right hand. It's so effective with the southpaw. Now Here the comes com- Mayweather. Now the combination. Mayweather hunting him down. McGregor tried to switch things up, moved out of the way, but still got tagged. Jeb, I didn't think his jab was going to be effective. McGregor just fighting to stay in the game. I mean, he's exhausted. No legs. Floyd Mayweather oh. continues to score. Mayweather was able to get some good offense done. McGregor with the jab, but a, a nice right hand by Mayweather over a very lazy jab by McGregor, in which McGregor was kind of caught between the lefty and righty stand. Now you see... Boxing is not an easy sport. It's a man sport, and you better know how to take a hit. Looking at that clip, seeing Conor McGregor trying his best to knock out Floyd Mayweather and Floyd letting him hit his face. He was baiting 
McGregor the whole night. He wanted to do that so that they could have more rounds. That means more money for both of them. He knew he could have knocked them out in the first round or probably before a millisecond. But Floyd is smart. Him and his team realize, how about we all drag this fight longer than expected? If anything, I don't think this will be a quick knockout. I think Floyd Mayweather would toy around with Logan Paul, uh, try to get the crowd involved. And then when it's like the eighth round or probably seventh, he'll go for the kill shot. That's what I predict. Um, if, and I know that Floyd is most likely is going to win this match. But if Logan Paul wins, he would have to do something so unpredictable that the viewers would be surprised he'll do. He'll have to gamble. And Floyd, that's not the best boxer to gamble with. But it's his only shot. <laughs> Meaning he has no shot to win this matchup. But shout out to Logan Paul for even attempting to box a legend like Floyd Mayweather. Shout out to Floyd Mayweather. No matter what you say about the brother, uh, he's always putting people on. He's always uh, creating a brand for others. And yes, he may not knock out every opponent all the time. But his defensive instincts are legendary. You can say that Floyd Mayweather probably has the best defense in boxing history. Bar none. No matter what weight class, heavyweight, middleweight, super heavyweight, it doesn't matter. Floyd Mayweather is the best defensive boxer in the history of boxing. So hopefully it's a fun matchup. I'm not going to be a hater. I know that Logan has not, quote-unquote, earned his stripes. But, hey, it's sports, it's entertainment, and the crowd wants to have fun. So they're going to give the people what they want. Stay tuned. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Like, share, support the content. All love. Peace.